friends so uh, today's session let's see how 2019 will be unfold for uh, aries sun sign moon sign or uh, aries ascendant so if you don't know what is your ascendant you can uh, google it how to calculate the ascendant and uh, if you are aries ascendant or um, your moon is uh, in aries or in the house so this session is for you hope you'll enjoy it let's see so i have already shuffled the card but uh, i still need to see what the cards is there for you so what one thing uh, let's focus on what one thing you don't have to worry in 2019 so there will be a lot of um you know forecast astrology uh, where you can see for your aries um sun sign moon sign or ascendant but in this video let's check what one thing um you are worried about um for a long time maybe it will uh, be fulfilled you don't have to worry about it anymore so looks like the cards are um, very interesting cards so let's see so uh, if you are a woman and uh, you are longing for um a new project or um, to try to do something new of your own um or you are trying for a baby if you see this is a pregnant lady this is a very uh, natural naturally blessed card and um, you see there's a harvest and um, coming january is the season of harvest so you have plenty of food and good health and your wish will also come true if you are trying to have a baby or you are starting a new project or um, new business this is the right time this is the right year and um, second thing is okay this is four of pentacles so this um this person is trying to open the treasure so if you are working towards something and uh, you are still waiting for a reward or um, a promotion so this this is the year you are going to get it you are getting very close to it but still you have been waiting for it so yes this is the year and what else this says yes yeah this also this card also says that um you may need to connect with the right person or the right key to open the treasure open the happiness of your life and this year you will find it another one so few of you are um, still working towards and uh, this is, is something like work in progress if you're still working day and night and um, you're creating a masterpiece you'll get recognition and um, yeah this is what this card is all about keep doing good work then there is another one okay this card jumped before this so let's see this what is it wanted to come first so this is queen of cups so this card is something like if you you will be get benefited um by a female uh, acquaintance or um, she must be in your relationship mother girlfriend sister some friend or somebody new you met so um, in case of single people there's a hope for love and um anybody who who is into arts who's into music who's who's going for audition all the best it's a very bright and successful year for you um don't miss the chance okay this is the card this is the last card so eight of wands so if you have aimed towards something i have already said some of the cards already um, sorted us that um, this is the year to reach to your destiny 
and um, they may be detour or you would have faced it or you are uh, in a situation when things are quite still see this is still and uh, you still need some more tricks to do some more trials before you get succeeded but uh, looks like you have already um, put the things in place so relax a bit and wait for the result all the best and let's see what are the messages you have i solely rely on this goddess guidance um, oracle card they have a great 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 um, wishes and um, guidance but um, really you are looking for at this moment let's see what are the the first one is easy does it you can also google it about this card and you can find a lot of meanings about it but at this present what i feel is um yeah which already i said no need to worry relax so the last card which which we got um <laughs> some of this is matches you have already done your job so relax um everything is occurring in a perfect timing so this is the timing and you have waited for long time if you are looking you know wanted to have a baby and you waited such a long time this is the time it's a good harvest start something new and uh, you have already planted a seed just wait for the result this is the second message is um yeah this is the second message um so Aries is also a sign of a uh, little aggressiveness and um, some of you um, spoil things by your temper or um, mm, compulsiveness. So this, this is the message from White Tara sensitivity. You are becoming increasingly sensitive. Avoid harsh relationship environment situations and chemicals so this is a general message but um, it looks like if you are in a relationship it's not working for you and you are feeling very vulnerable try to keep a distance that's the message is all about and um, focus on the result whatever you have already worked this is the last one what's unfolding for you it's a quiet time this is CQ okay take some quiet time alone to rest meditate and contemplate so please you know meditate and um, it's, it's really helpful and um, it will also clear your mind and uh, calm you from your aggressiveness and um, harshness sometime and uh, no need to be harsh and then feel bad afterwards so better um, whatever you are going to talk uh, to your family or your um, um, in your office um, rehearsal that in your mind once and see are you hurting somebody it's something you are just speaking so that other person can feel bad because they have hurt you before so Try to uh, revise that um, conversation in your head before you speak. And this year is going to be a great year. Hope this um, brings all the happiness and uh, mm, fulfill all your dreams. And uh, just if you if you really love this reading, uh, give me a like and help me with more subscribers. And Happy New Year. Take care.